Okay, this is officially Times Square. It's not every day that you see a cowboy on horseback in the middle of New York City. I told you I was going to do it. But it is something Johnny Warnsize has dreamed of for a long time. It's taken me a year and a half to get to New York. That's because he traveled all 4,400 miles on horseback. He saddled up in California March of last year and rode into the Big Apple November 15th. And he did it all to raise awareness for Guillain-Barre, a disease that affects the nervous system that left his mother temporarily paralyzed. That's a pretty extensive treatment to get him to walk again. Well, it took a year and a half and we spent all our money and I decided to ride across country on horseback to raise awareness for it. And that chilly day in November, he didn't just reach his destination. He also took his mom along for the ride. How I cried. All the time I was paralyzed, he kept promising me he would get me back on a horse, and he did. But the journey wasn't just long, it was also dangerous. While riding through Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, one of his horses reared back and landed on top of him, shattering his ankle. After uh, he rolled off of my leg, I could see the bottom of my shoe. I knew that wasn't normal. It took 15 screws to put his ankle back together, and the injury kept him off the horse for six weeks. It was devastating, actually, you know, to think, oh, I made it this far. I'm so close, yet so far away. But with the help of strangers along the way, he eventually made it to New York with a healthy mom and a brand new outlook on life. I learned more about humanity on this trip than I did about, you know, just riding a horse. It brought back my faith in God and humanity for sure.